Hey everybody, right up here we have a plane that passes through three non-collinear points. Check it out. Those three black dots, those three points, are non-collinear. That means they do not lie on the same line. And given any three points that don't lie on a line, you can slice or pass exactly one flat sheet or one flat plane between them. Euclidean geometry we're talking now. So what would happen if we were to make those points collinear? Check it out. Why did the plane disappear? Well, there is a plane that passes through those three collinear points, but aren't there actually infinitely many? That's why when we name a plane in Euclidean geometry, we need three non-collinear points to name that plane, because if we have three collinear points, we have infinitely many planes that pass through those three collinear points. So, we can actually just take one of these out right here. All we need to do is move them up, and we got our unique plane. Right? There's only one and only one flat plane that passes through any three non-collinear points, and it's shown right there.